QB. Okay, right there, you can see Patty Mills is not backing off, and Jakar is not backing off. Pirtle tries to move it, and then you see Gay get it in the middle of it. I don't know if you call that instigator or not. Coro took a blow. That's his own rebound. And a travel call. Oh, is Coro and Sampson getting mixed up? Coro didn't like that, and now they jaw at each other. Lamar Stevens, who has just checked in, got over there quickly, and now Jakar Sampson just got tossed. Yeah, he, he really just mouthing off. In that situation, did not call for any of that. He likes to go fishing during his breaks. Metu caught a big fish there and caught a ride on Valanciunas. I'm not sure any of that was malicious. I think Valanciunas felt that Metu was caught up on his shoulders. And just simply tried to discard him. Yeah, well, don't be mad that I put you in the hole. Yeah. Ride him, cowboy, says Metu. And and this is the little bit of nastiness that is the, the Grizzlies. And you remember you're in attendance at the Barclays Center. They're hoping to increase that. I have to go by according to state government regulations in New York, which is 10% capacity. Irving call for the foul. And it's going to be his second. Here's the fans here. Right now there are 21 teams that have fans. Minnesota's about to join them. And when the Lakers finish their road trip and go home, their first game back, they're going to have fans along with the Clippers as Irving and Schroeder going at it. Somebody's been hit with a technical. Could be a double technical. Zach Zarba, who's the crew chief, trying to calm Irving down. So it is a double technical. Well, they got into it, or Schroeder was upset with what he thought was the referee not calling fouls on Irving in one-on-one -on -one situation. And Kyrie Irving is just thrown out. Yep. Irving thrown out. He continued his conversation. But was walking away. Schroeder's happy with it. Odd Haslam. And now Haslam's having words with Dwight Howard. I'm loving this right now. Uh oh, oh and, uh, here we uh, go. Haslam pointing the finger may have made contact. He talked about his toughness before, Raji. There is a certain sense of urgency to this game for both teams. Although Miami has jumped in front with red hot shooting. This is great because these two teams potentially could see one another in the second round. See, first of all, he. Howard throws him to the ground here on this uh, as they, they got tangled up for a, a rebound. And now here's the words between Haslam. And there's the point. May have been contact. Yeah. Yep. He's Tossed. gone. They, they ejected him. Up, no whistle. Wow. <laughs> they say play on, length of the court. And that's a foul. Oh, whoa, whoa, oh, whoa. That, no, that should be a flag. Oh, look out. That was OG. And that is a wrestling move, taking down Schroeder. Schroeder was, Schroeder was holding him up, and I don't know what he was thinking. He actually almost ended up body slamming Schroeder. Yeah, the, the, the officials coaches. will look at this. If they review this, uh, I'm very interested to see what the outcome will be. And restoring order as both benches spill on to the court. Here so he doesn't fall. Now he gets up and like that's just ridiculous. And look at Trez coming in. Trez is coming in there. Gary Trent was in the middle of it too. Yeah, but the third man in usually is the guy that gets penalized the most. So well, we'll see who they rule as the third man in. Is that going to be Trez or is it going to be Gary Trent? Here's player altercation. Personal foul on Soder. Plays under further review. All right, they're going to take a look at this, and there's a lot to unpack here with this replay and what just went down between Ananobi and Schroeder and tennis hot and there's Gary Trent looked at the time as always trying to break up but then Trez came in of course to protect his guy and look at Markeith 
you know, he's going to come in and. Irving pokes it away. Good hands from Kyrie Irving. And then Beverly and Harden, former teammates in Houston, shove each other. That was a hard foul from Beverly that Harden took an exception to. Hard foul? Absolutely. Oh, my goodness. Mike's gotten soft. Got? <laughs> James Harden's on my side on that one. Oh, that's brutal. <laughs> Well, that's a flagrant five. It, it doesn't look as impactful in slow motion. <laughs> and then they pushed each other. There was no technicals? Well, during that timeout, Dwight Howard was ejected from this game. Those two going at it, Harrell and Dwight Howard. And that bump right there, official Kane Fitzgerald comes in and ejects Dwight Howard. And Ben Simmons also picking up a tee. So that just happened during the timeout. After that, we had a chance to visit with Doc Rivers, Reggie Miller, with the head coach of the city. To the rescue. Hi, Rudy, just making it look easy. Got run off the three-point line. Didn't matter to him. Right into his mid-range game. McCollum's miss. Cantor's rebound. Blocked by Gay. Cantor again, and he is fouled here. And a little upset with DeRozan there. DeRozan took a swipe at it. He caught more of Enos than he did the basketball. And Cantor obviously a little upset about that. It's hard to tell exactly what happened. Now, obviously.